So today I am back with our second tutorial and today I'm going to show you guys how to edit out objects or people from the backgrounds of your pictures because I know when I have that perfect picture and there's something or someone there it just kills me. So I found this app a while back and it's super convenient. I want to say it's free, I'm not positive, but let's see. It's called Retouch. Take it here to retouch, you go to albums, you click on the picture that you want. So here you have object removal, quick repair, and line removal. And I've never used the other ones, I only use object removal. So right now I'm just going through and I'm editing everything that's next to the background of the blue ocean. And once you're finished outlining that out, you want to fill it all in and press go can't really tell that he was edited out. So I'm going to go back to where his elbow was. And as you can see that turns out really well. And now this is where it gets tricky when it's really textured and um, especially on the edge of the walkway. So here I'm just going to outline his shadows and his foot. So as you can see, the walkway kind of gets weird and distorted. So you kind of just go back and forth until it's your preferred look. And next, same thing here. You just want to edit where it's the same colored background. So I'm going to leave her feet out of it because they're in front of a different background. I'm just going to edit up these little spots. And next, I'm going to move on to her feet and her shadow. As you can see, it came out pretty good. There's still a little bit of stuff I need to fix. So I'm just gonna take out that line right there, and boom, those two people are removed. So now you can see that there are a pair of John glass that are not mine, so I am taking those out. This one should be pretty simple, it's very small. So there's that. And lastly, the shadow of this woman is just completely messing up with the vibe. So I'm gonna go over, since it's all over the same texture, you don't have to uh, separate the object into different parts. And there, her leg kind of gets all deformed, just keep removing that. So I'm going to Visco now. I'm importing that picture. Once again, C8. Crop her out just a tad. And play with the HSL. And there is the final product. So that is how I edit people and objects out of my pictures. Um, I love looking like I'm going on these cool solo adventures and there's no one else around, but obviously when you go to touristy places, there are going to be a lot of people. Um, so editing people and objects out does take a lot of time and a lot of patience. You probably will have to restart a couple of times, I know I did with that edit, I just didn't put it in because I didn't want this video to be too terribly long. I think my biggest tip for doing this is stick with the textures. Um, so yeah, I hope that was helpful to you guys and I will see you next time on how to edit a picture with a moving background. Like this one. Okay, so that's all for today and thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs> Don't forget to like and subscribe.